Hi, by this time I'm assuming you would have done your basic Ionic installation and uh, I'm now going ahead to create a project. So the way to do it is you use this Ionic start and then you give your project name. So what I will do is in my project name currently I will probably name it uh, not in my app, say some gym app, okay. And uh, I'll use the template side menu and uh, because I have a higher version installed I would use this uh, uh, option of hyphen hyphen type and ionic one so i am insisting that i want an ionic one uh, to be the, to be uh, the template so it does that it goes ahead and downloads uh, a few files that it needs so we'll just wait for this to be done what would happen is a folder will be created so if this is our command a folder will be created like this like gym app so it would ask me for uh, ionic app flow sdk currently i don't need that so i'll say no to it and it is done so if i just do a list of my let me clear the screen and i do a list so you see that gym app is created so i'll go to uh, gym app and uh, there is a folder here now from here i can run ionic serve hyphen all so once i do this the service is started and uh, a, it does check that okay i don't have the ionic lab it's go ahead and say yes you'd want that to be installed and then your app will be available on uh, the local host 8100 this is the url and uh, here there you see the app is available and I'll run through the code and the changes in the app in the next video.